What's up guys? We're here at the Atlanta United game. I am not wearing an Atlanta United jersey because we didn't do laundry. So I'm wearing my limited edition Jeff shirt from Rooster Teeth. Uh, we're gonna head on inside. They're playing the Montreal Impact today, so it should be a fucking good game. Catch you guys in there.
so yeah, we're back home now. Uh, the game was, hmm, the game was good in the sense that we won, but the game was not good in the sense that minus 15 minutes of play, we kind of played like absolute trash most of that game. Um, I was very unimpressed with our play through the first half and probably through the first like 60 minutes. Um, we do not know how to attack against a team that parks the bus on us. And once Montreal got that first goal, uh, 15 minutes in, I mean, they literally, there were times when all 11 players were in like, not even their half, they were just in like 35 yards. And so we're trying to slam balls. We had 34 crosses at the end of the match to their three right and it's like guys the first 26 didn't work the next 17 aren't gonna work right none of our goals came off of crosses in fact all of our goal three of our four goals came off of set pieces right a pk two free kicks and then really kind of an error on montreal's part like they like it just hit off the dude's foot like it didn't wasn't really a pass back by martinez but like yeah we just <clears throat> didn't look like we came out there to play. It didn't look like we came out there thinking that, well, it looked like we came out there thinking that we were just going to, like, raffle stomp Montreal, um, I guess because they're pretty low in the bracket. Like, we just thought we were going to have a super easy time. And uh, that just, you know, wasn't the case, you know. <clears throat> they did to us what we did to a lot of teams, you know, score quick on a quick, quick little counter. Um, and then they were like, cool. We're cool beating you 1-0 at home because we know it's, like, impossible to score goals here. And we just do not have an attack plan. Like, there was a moment probably 40 minutes into the first half where LGP got the ball at the top of the box. And you could tell he was like, oh, should I shoot the ball? Like, And he had, like, space and time and could have easily taken, like, a small touch and just ripped one. But it was like he was so uncomfortable doing that. Now, granted, he's a defender, right? But our fucking team just does not shoot outside of the box. And they constantly try to cross it and constantly try to do like these little small plays through the midfield. That's another big thing that we really need to stop doing is like we're like a person who's playing FIFA who doesn't know how to do like a deep lob or a deep cross. And we're just like passing it to every person to get it to the person we need it to go to. And so it's like, you know, a ball that could go from, you know, <clears throat> McCann to Gressel or it could go from, you know, LGP over to uh, Garza or someone else who is in the left wing. Like, it has to go through fucking Parkhurst to McCann to fucking Garza. Or even, like, sometimes it'll go, like, McCann to Guzan to Parkhurst to LGP to fucking, you know, Nagmi or Lorinowitz in the middle over to fucking, you know, um, over to Gressel. And what it does when, you know, someone's playing so defensively like Montreal was, you just see them shift, right? You just see the whole team, right? And it's just, they just shift back and forth and they don't have to do anything because they're not defending. You're just playing the ball completely laterally. You're not getting any vertical movement. And so <clears throat> I feel like that's, absolutely something that we need to work on is how do we have a more penetrating attack how does our attack have more depth right because if you look at the teams that we struggled against last year they played well against our style of play and if you look at the teams that we're you know playing against right now like <clears throat> even the la result although it was a good game and although there were chances on both sides right like our break was a pk right we had two pks in that game and it's like we're drawing a lot of PKs right now because we're getting into the box, we're crashing in the box, and, and, and they're, they're good opportunities and good chances for us. But our attack doesn't have a lot of diversity, right? Um, there was a moment in the game today where there was a corner kick, and Almiron was like trying to get Barco to come over for a short corner, and you could tell Barco was like, no, just take the fucking corner. Like, you don't need to, you know, do a short corner every single time. And, you know... <clears throat> honestly, we should just have fucking Kratz on the field. Literally, he could just fucking sit there and do nothing and then just take all our fucking set pieces because he's the only person on the team that does a fucking decent set piece. Um, 
I mean, he his fucking free kicks are insane. I literally think he's taken four free kicks and scored four free goals. Um, like literally just incredible, incredible, uh, over the ball. So yeah. Um, you know, like I said, I, it, it's like enjoyed the game cause we won four to one and it was great, but it was like literally, you know, at halftime I was like, we look like shit and you know, it's, you know, it was a low attend. It, they said there was 45,000 people there. I was fucking there. There weren't that many people there. Um, unless a shit ton of people just never sat down in their seats. But like, you know, maybe it was like a low attendance game. Maybe it was just like, like not a very like energetic game for the, you know, for the squad. But it was like, you guys didn't show up to play. And Montreal honestly had, I mean, they were fine just counterattacking on quick breaks. They had a couple other opportunities um, it wasn't like, you know, we just fucking had, you know, 85% possession and, you know, we were just trying to slam it into a brick wall. There were moments where, you know, they, they could have went up 2-0. Two, two, oh, they could have went up, you know, th- you know, you know, tied it back 2-2. Two, two. So, I don't know. It's just something we, I feel like we need to think about. It's something I feel like we need to do a little bit better on. Um, so, that's going to be it for the day's vlog. Just another soccer vlog. I like these. Uh, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow.